my name is Adrian Wilkes. I'm a Farm Bureau member from Fairfield County. I'm also a pork producer. My wife and I operate fat bottom pigs. We raise Berkshire pigs uh, for meat production. Today I'm gonna read Awesome Agriculture, Pigs, an A to Z book by Susan Anderson and Joanne Buggy. A is for agriculture. Agriculture is awesome. Pigs are part of agriculture. Farmers who raise pigs are called pork producers. The meat from pigs is called pork. B is for barns. These are some of the kinds of barns where pigs are raised. As pigs grow, they often get moved to different barns. C is for clean. Farmers want their barns to be as clean as possible. Pigs are clean animals. D is for drink. It is very important for pigs to have enough water to drink. Special waterers are used so pigs can drink any time. E is for eat. Pigs eat feed made mostly of corn, soybeans, and wheat. Pork producers give their pigs feed that is rich in vitamins and minerals. F is for farm. Pigs are raised on this farm. Corn and soybeans are also grown here. Many farmers store feed in grain bins located on their farms. Other farmers buy corn and soybeans from their neighbors. G is for grocery store. Pork is found in many foods in your grocery store. Look for foods made from pork. Hot dogs, pepperoni, sausage, ham, and bacon are some of the products made from pork. H is for hog. Hog is another name for pig. Pigs are also called swine. A group of pigs is called a herd. I. I is for inside. Hog farmers want the inside of their barns to be as free of germs as possible. Before going into a barn, people usually need to shower and put on special clothes. J. J is for jobs. Many people have jobs working with pigs and pork. Maybe someday you will have a job working with pigs or pork. K. K is for no. Did you know these things contain something from pigs? Parts of pigs other than meat can be processed into useful things like the gelatin and desserts and the bristles and paintbrushes. L. L is for lean. Farmers want to raise lean pigs. Years ago, pigs were fatter. Today's pigs are lean. They have little fat. M. M is for my plate. Pork is in the protein section of my plate. Some of the ways we eat pork are chops, tenderloin, roast, or ribs. N. N is for nutrition. Pork also has vitamins and minerals needed for good nutrition. Pork is the world's leading farm-raised meat. O. O is for oink. Oink is the sound people think pigs make. Pigs also make other sounds. For example, they grunt and squeal. P. P is for piglet. A newborn pig is called a piglet. A mother pig is called a sow. A male pig is a boar. Q. Q is for quality. Pork producers want quality animals for their farms. Young people can learn the best ways to raise pigs in organizations like 4-H and the National Junior Swine Association. R. R is for research. Research helps farmers raise fast-growing, healthy pigs. Farmers want to protect the environment. Research helps them do this. S. S is for snout. A pig's nose is called a snout. Pigs have a very good sense of smell. T. T is for temperature. Hog farmers want the temperature in their barns to be warm in the winter and cool in the summer. Fans and heaters help keep the pigs comfortable. U. 
U is for United States. Pigs are raised in all parts of the United States. The top three pig producing states are Iowa, Minnesota, and North Carolina. The pink states are the 10 biggest producers. V. V is for veterinarian. A veterinarian works with the farmer to raise healthy pigs. The veterinarian often comes to the farm to check on the pigs. W. W is for wash. Always wash your hands before and after handling pork. Washing your hands is important when working with all foods. X. X marks the spot. Find X on this label. It shows there's pork in the product. Look for pork on labels in your grocery store. Y. Y is for you. What did you learn about pigs? These are my favorite pages about pigs. What are yours? Z. Z to A or A to Z. Pigs are awesome. We all agree. I really enjoyed reading this book for you today. My favorite part about the book was how we were able to use each letter of the alphabet to learn something new about pigs. Did you know that in South Carolina, pork producers produced over 5 million pounds of pork just in 2020? So next time you have bacon or sausage for breakfast, or you eat a hot dog or a pork chop for supper, remember that that came from a pig, and those pigs are produced by farmers right here in South Carolina.